Wow, look how beautiful and peaceful this settlement location is. I found it um, last video and I'd like to try to get a settler here first thing. So um, it's not yet connected to my supply lines obviously so I might not have what I need on hand but let's see if I can at least make a radio bacon. need rubber. Alright, I think I saw some tires. Dog meat, let's go get some rubber. Isn't there? Yeah, there's a tire here. There's some rubber. Oh, there it goes. Alright, so I like putting my radio beacons really high up. So let's put it up here. And now, okay, I need to get power to this dude. Oops. So let's see, um, I can make a small generator. I'm gonna put this guy, like, over here. And then... Um, oh, I need copper. I can't connect it yet. You know what? When I was looking through the house, I thought I saw... Um, one of those lampshade things. I think they have copper in them. Is it over here? Yeah. There it is. Copper! Um, let's go downstairs. And attach that baby! We need to get our first settler! Yeah! Alright! <laughs> Alright, so while waiting for my set first settler to arrive, I'm gonna start um, scrapping everything. There's trees here. Whoa, what's that? That was really loud. There's trees um, on this on this settlement. Um, and then there's um, oh, that's right. Maybe that made this noise. There's like I hate these things. They get stuck. <laughs> I'll never be able to get it out. And I noticed there's like dead Brahmins everywhere. There's one there and then there's one in a really bad location. Like, it's gonna trip everyone up right here. But yes, there's trees, which means there'll be wood and wood is in dire need. I'm in dire need of wood. So I'm gonna get to work. Um, and then just so you can see on my map, this is where I am, the Taffington Boathouse. It's um, kind of close to like Lexington. It's over here, south of that Med Medford Memorial Hospital. So I am just gonna be scrapping all this good stuff and waiting for my settler. I found a bunch of concrete in the water, like, kinda have to dig around for like stuff hiding. Any more? Oh, there's a tire there. Oh, it's a car <laughs> under the water. Yeah, I wish we could like select bodies and make them disappear because I don't really like having that Brahmin. I cannot move it. It's way too heavy. Can I get rid of this thing? Yeah. I wonder if I can build like... I wish we could repair the roof. But it might be a little bit tricky. I love it. I like that it's kind of like a complete house. It's so pretty. Over the water. Another tire. Another. More rubber. And it's, you know, it's not the biggest area. It's kind of like just in the water and then this part of the road. Uh oh. Who are they? Oh, maybe those are two new settlers? I don't know. Guess I'll find out. They're coming this way. Where are you guys? They don't look like settlers because they're wearing, like, armor. There's, like, a telephone thing going. I wonder if there's fake electricity. Yeah, maybe that's not real electricity. Another car. Lots of 
wood, which I'm in dire need of. I think I'm gonna keep this wire fence here. I guess it's kind of like maybe a Brahmin can be pinned up in here eventually. Oh, I'll get rid of that one. Wood. Let's see who those guys are. Wow, who are you people? Who are you? you know a settler. A day? Wow. Without an empty stomach. I've never yes. seen a settler come like wearing that much armor. So since I have two now, it seems. Can we trade? Let's see what you have on you. Go ahead. All right. So yeah, he's wearing this harness thing. I like to take everything. You know what? I'm not sure if I have any weapon. Oh, I have a combat shotgun. I'm not using that one. So I'm gonna give him some ammo, and I think that's you know I'm not. I think of me. Yeah, maybe I'll just give him a hat. <laughs> All right, so he looks pretty pretty good. I think I'm gonna um, put him on a supply line because the suit I have two now, so I really if I could get one of them connected to a supply line, I'll have access to all my workshop stuff, and I can actually like do something here and build a little bit better. So this lady over here, I'm gonna have her um, sure. do some of that, and he's gonna he's gonna be my. Um, Supply line. Oh, I'm so happy two came. That really makes my life easier. So This is how my supply lines look right now. So Taffington's gonna be connected to sunshine um, So right now, yeah, everyone's connected. This is these are my settlements uh, Sanctuary they're just unhappy and then yeah, I'm gonna need to give them food water defenses really badly but that's fine. I'm gonna do a quick save. And I think I'm gonna put a little bit more food down if I have it. Let's see. Okay, let's give them some carrots. Alright, so that's a little bit more food. And then water. They have a lot of water here. Um, I wanna see though, instead of putting it over there, will it like fit? Oh wow. How far? Okay, there's. Oh, this is kind of. Because I want to put it near my. Well, actually, this requires two. Yeah, I might be able to only put one for now, but let's see. Let's put this guy. Like, right here. Will you reach? Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> All right, so it's getting connected through that beacon. Oh, I didn't really ever realize that. I can, oh, okay. So that's now powering the water purifier and my beacon. Oh my God, so cool. Um, I think I could scrap that, yeah. I'm gonna get more stuff to scrap. Um, kinda hard to get around this thing. I'll just go in the water. Scrap that. I'm gonna get rid of all this stuff. I, I don't really, you know, I want to make room for what I want to put here. Um, kind of interesting. I wonder if water purifiers can fit in this thing. <laughs> I'll get rid of this. Some concrete. Oh, I love this. It's so pretty. It's awesome. What's in this thing? I scrap that? It's got a fuse of, mm. It looks so pretty. I don't know if I want to take it down for scrap. Yeah, I think I'm going to leave it. It looks so pretty. I think I'm going to put the turrets up on top of this. The, like, I don't know what you call it. Up on top of that, the roof part of the house. Get rid of this. Um, did I get all the wood? I need to make sure I got all the wood, man. There's dog meat. Is this a shovel? Yeah, that's a shovel. I think that has wood on it. Yeah, it's got three wood. I really wish I could move this Brahmin. Uh-oh. Dog meat's playing with his teddy bear. Is there any more wood around here? I think that was it. 
I'm running really low on wood in general. Alright, so that looks like that's it for the outside. Oh, we can pick up this thing. But if we go inside, um... Oh wait, do the people sit on these cinder blocks? I don't know. But I'm not gonna scrap that. You know, I don't mind keeping that there. Um, yeah, I guess I could keep that there. Get rid of that. I wish I could move that bug. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna put proper beds instead of that. The kitchen, it's like they don't use it. So I'm just gonna scrap it for steel. What was that? Uh, more ceramic. And then let's go check up upstairs, which I think for now I'd like to, um, instead of building a new structure, I mean a lot of times the settlements that I, um, um, I usually make new structures, but this house is so awesome, I think I'd like to keep it. Like make this the main living area. Um, uh, take, we'd scrap these pictures because there's no, there's nothing to see. I'll scrap the toilet and then... Oh, there's that poor lady. Um, I'll scrap this. What's that? Scrap this, scrap that. Um, do I want to scrap the safe? Yeah, why not? Yeah, there's like a break in the wall, so I wonder if I can make a third floor, but it looks kind of tricky because, I don't know, there's very little space. Very, very little space. So let's bring that sleeping bag upstairs. Um, yeah, for now I'll keep the sleeping bags, but I prefer to give them actual beds. There's two bugs in this room, oh god. It can't move them, they're stuck. <laughs> what about this poor lady? This is her house. Her family all died. Maybe we should give her a proper burial. Where would she want to be buried, dog me? I think she'd want to be buried. She'd want um, to be put off to sea in a boat, but we don't have a boat. So we'll just let her float down the river. Goodbye, lady. Thank you for letting us use your house. There she goes. Um, alright. So, can I give her stuff? Let's give her something to wear. She's so smiley. Uh -huh. Very nice lady. Perfect to farm in. And then I'm going to store my junk. Alright, let's save it. And I'm going to get to work inside. Hmm, this is going to be a bit tricky. I can already tell. Oh, defenses. Maybe I should do that first. Yeah. I should do the defenses first. Before I start building. Alright, I could do 13 of these, but... Uh, let's see if I can put one right here at this corner. For now, let's just put it on the corners. One there. Um, I'm not sure if bad guys will come from the river. They you would think they would most likely come from the road. So maybe I can put it up on this rock. Will it work? Oh, it will. <laughs> that's pretty cool. All right, that's it for now for the the uh, defenses. It's still not enough, but let's let's go work inside. Uh oh, it can fit here, but I'm afraid it's gonna be nowhere to go. Like, I can make stairs, but where is it gonna go? Because it's not high enough. Like, if you look, it's hitting the, it's not, like, above. Hmm. Maybe I should put it on this side. Oh, 
Oh, it might not work over here. Alright, so I just placed it here. Alright, so it just allows me to get up, but... It's so awkward. There's nowhere... It's not high enough, dog me! Uh-oh, you're gonna fall. Oh, cool, though. I could do that. Dog me, what, what should we do? <laughs> um, let me think about this. Can we put a floor? Well, we'd have to use a smaller floor. Can we put this here? Oh, it won't let us? Oh, it, well, it's snapping to that one. I wish it was... Yeah. Oh, 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 I saw it. It pop up. Oh, I might not be able to, like, hmm. Even if I can't, like, put a stair thing up here, at least it'll make it look more like a roof. Uh-oh. Can I snap to that? Will it let me snap to it? It's kind of awkward. I'm trying to like pick it up where I can see what I'm doing better. Oh, it's snapping on the bottom. I need that this way. It's not tall enough. This stairwell is just not tall enough. Hmm. Maybe I can make another stair to like snap to this one. Well, that's weird. I don't know if it's gonna work, dog meat. I don't know if it's gonna work, Mr. Dog Meat. Maybe I can have it, the stairwell, like, go down there. What snaps to the other one or just that one? Just that one. Yeah, it's a little bit weird. It's just jutting out. I don't know. But, yeah, I could build something, like, out this direction, but it's gonna use a lot of flooring, and I don't have... I've got 300 wood, which is a lot of wood, because of all those trees. The question is, do I really want to do that? Do I want to do that? Do it like that. Yeah, let's maybe make a structure. I don't know. Do I want to make the front of the house look like not a house? That's basically what I'm doing. Or I could just maybe make the stairwell like go above the house this way. By the way, the settlers are going to have a trouble, I think, getting up here because that's not really like it's not very good connection not a very good connection right now unless I do something like that it's gonna look ridiculous <laughs> it's gonna look ridiculous man absolutely ridiculous Alright, so let's just fill out this. I kind of like filling this out, making it look more like a roof. But that's the most that I can do.
there. I think that that's all it'll let me do. So now it's more like a roof. So when it rains, they don't get that wet. <laughs> As for this, I don't know. Maybe I should have it wrap around. Yeah, maybe we should do it that way instead. So, for now, I'm going to store this and put back. I wish I could put it against the eyes. Yeah, it won't let me. So, let's do this. Let's just make this freaky looking walkway. And we'll go this way. <laughs> Maybe one more. This is gonna be so weird! Hmm. I want to go down. You stay there for a bit. Let me think about this. Um, I probably have to lay a floor down before it will let me do anything. Let's see if I can make this semi straight. Is that well it's a little bit I want a little bit further. Yeah. Alright, so can I put a stairwell? Can I link these two guys? Hmm. Don't be annoying, please. Ta-da! Didn't work. It didn't work. Stop snapping. Maybe I can bridge the distance to going like that. <sighs> All I can think of is to, um... Let me store this again. I don't think it'll let me use the concrete because I'm on the. Yeah, it won't let me. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is very big, very difficult. Very difficult. Let me think about this for a second. Alright, I think I figured it out. Um, at least a workable solution. So now when people come out here, they go down this stairs and I made this platform. You kind of see it's like over, it's like in between this area and, um, I don't know, it's kind of cool. And then this stairwell snapped to here. So now I have this kind of cool little level thing going on. But now I still have to connect it to the ground floor because people can't really get up here. So, um, try to decide how to do that. I really like it so far. It's really cool. Maybe I'll have it go out that way, but... Hmm, how shall I do this? Yeah, maybe at the front. I'm gonna probably have to move. You know, let me save it first. I'm probably gonna have to move, move this guy. Let's move him right here. It looks like he's floating. <laughs> and I'm gonna need more wood. I'm trying not to use too much wood. Because I'm gonna need to save some for the walls. I mean, I'm gonna use mostly metal walls, but you still sometimes need it, you know. Alright, so let's do... Uh, maybe one of these again. That snap down. Do you mind this this thing is in your area, lady? Then of course I'd have to lower it one more time. 
Hmm. Um. I kind of feel like maybe using cement for the base. Have it snap. The question is, do I want it on this side? It's kind of really large. You, yeah. Let's do that there, and then we'll need one more stairs going down. So, should we do it? Maybe one here, and one on the other side. Um, can I fit it like, kind of like that, but this thing's kind of in the way. Hmm. Let's let's reorganize this. Let's push the garden. We've got a lot of room for gardening. So let's push it. And then let's have this go on this side. Yeah, I think I like that better. Have that go cuz I want to be able to kind of connect people walking like from here to there. And maybe something like on this side. Yeah. Alright, I think I like that better. So now people can get up here. Strangle themselves on that, those wires right there. <laughs> Eventually there's going to be a room thing up here. And then people can also um, go all the way up here. Maybe they'll have a like, guard post or something. And they have a beautiful view of everything right here. Oh, it's so exciting. Alright, I'm gonna get to work. I'm gonna I think I'll build this out next. I'll show you that when I'm done. Yeah, I decided to make it a little bit wider and to put a stairwell. I'm really using up a lot of wood, so Yeah, I'm kind of splurging a little bit on this element because I love it. I love the way it looks. Just looks so awesome. I'm really happy. So let's just get this going. Sometimes it's hard to like <laughs> get it to go where you want. There we go. All right, let's put up some walls now. Oh wait, we want metal walls. Metal walls because I've got so much metal, so I'm gonna use the ones that use just steel and no wood. I don't really like these. I wish they had ones that had windows. I'd like to have more windows in my life, cause look at these views. They're so gorgeous. I hate blocking off the view, so. I won't do it in all the wall. I won't have it completely. Not every angle. Maybe just that way. Yeah. But for these, oh geez, I'm gonna have because the really the only things that look more when like light and open are these walls. Like the ones like this where you can see out into the gorgeous view. So I'm gonna splurge and get that. I splurged maybe one here so you can see the front. But upstairs. Upstairs, I feel a little bit more guilty because I'm using up so much wood. I only have 84 left. So for now, I think I'm just gonna go with metal walls. And I realized when I was on the second floor, so this is that top floor, I actually could get a stair to snap to this upper level. So now people can have two ways onto this part of the building, which I love! Oh my god, I love this. Alright, so let's put some roof on this baby. It's getting kind of dark. So let's get them a roof in metal, because I've got so much metal. Let's use this one. Um, let's put it here. Here. Is that better? 
better. That's better. And then, for these weird gaps, um, I like to use this thing to make it seem, well, hopefully they won't fall, but I don't really have enough wood to do that everywhere. So I'm going to leave most of it open. Um, usually I like to close these things, like the sides with, um, there's like panels that fit, fit perfectly. Wooden walls. Where are they? They're usually at the end, like this stuff, but they use up four wood and one steel. Like, how do I want to splurge? Yeah, maybe just over there, but not this side. Yeah, maybe I'll close that one off. And that one. You, oh, this one's not working. Hmm, that one won't work. <laughs> I don't know why. But yeah, I think that's it. So, now what I'd like to do is add more defenses because they definitely probably need more. So let's add another turret. Something quick and easy. Right up here. This guy got a pretty good view. side? Can I fit one under there? Oh, it won't fit. Hmm. Will you fit right there? Yep. Right there. Let's angle them a little bit to the this way. There he goes. <laughs> Alright, so now um do I still only have two settlers here? Yeah, two people. One's doing the supply line, one's on the farm. We could make this a little bit bigger. Let's expand this out, because right now it looks kind of weird. Right? So, this will be another room. Another nice room for my settlers. Okay, so metal walls. Let's put some. Let's put one of these guys. With the roof. This will, I don't know what this is, um, like a community area. Let's move the kitchen thing. Cause you wouldn't think you would want to put, that probably needs to be more open air. Maybe like, maybe right here. Let's, let me see. Hmm. What fit in this little weird thing I just did? Yeah. <laughs> so I put it right there. It looks kind of weird, doesn't it? But at least it keeps it out of the way. So let's make this into a nice little eating area for the settlers. So let's put a table here. Well, you know, the settlers have the indoor area. Oh, was that? Isn't there another guy over here? Yeah. Oh, I could at least move him. Let's put a Brahmin thing here, just in case we get a Brahmin. Let's put it right here. I'm really mad that this guy's dead right there. Can't move them. 
Let's scrap that. Yeah, it's a really nice living area in here. The question is, where do I want to have the beds for the settlers? Um, I love this. This is so cool. I could put them up here. Yeah, let's maybe... Let's make this house the settler sleeping area. So let's put... Uh, some beds. Some nice beds in here for the settlers. Like that. Let's give them a suitcase so they can put their belongings somewhere. We'll put it under their beds. And... Um, let's let's splurge on some paintings. This uses up wood, so I don't do this as much as I used to. Let's do this one. I like this one. Probably have a lot of cloth. I could make some rugs. Let's do the really fancy rugs. Fancy rugs. How about, um, some nice seating area? So I really like these futuristic metal looking ones. Actually, let's put that downstairs. How about in this corner? This could be a nice little place for them to hang out right here. Um, I'm not sure if I have... Oh, I have a lot of copper now, that's right, because I'm connected to the... Yeah, let's put another generator right here. Kind of a weird spot for it, but it works. <laughs> and then... Um... Well, let's see if we can get some light working up in here. Another light upstairs. And then let's string this thing along the wall. Will it go this far? Yeah. That way we can move the light over here. Can I put it right here? Yay! <laughs> that was hard. And let's put it up here. This should be able to work now. Let's do a fancy light. Let's do a fancy one. Maybe something like this. Yeah, that's fancy. And a disco one. Yes! <laughs> Alright. Um... So that should be it for, I mean, let's see, what else can I really do? Alright, so I'm all done and I'm sleeping now so that it would be daylight. Oh, I wanted to show you everything, but now it looks creepy. <laughs> I wanted the sunlight. Um, I guess I could still show you. Hopefully the storm will blow over soon. Um, you can kind of see Dog and I are on the roof of the house and I put a bed here. Um, uh, whenever I have a location, a settlement, I always try to make one area just mine, so I kind of decided to put it over here. Eventually, eventually I'll add more stuff, maybe, I don't know. This, this is what it looks like so far, and you can see there's the beacon here. Um, uh, but let me go downstairs now to show you. So this pathway is still here. Kind of see I have a turret there. There's a way to go up here or down. Let's go up. Um, I've got some lights working. This is the room for settlers. I still only have two assigned here, but I put a lot of lights. There's this freestanding light and the disco ball, and there's five beds in here. 
um, with suitcases underneath them and some rugs and a painting. Down here, I wanted to have a view of the awesome lake, so I left this all open. Uh, right now, there's not much over here, just a generator and a nice little seating area. Wow, it's so creepy awesome. <laughs> you go down this level, this is kind of like just a, for a walkway. Um, you can reach this. So there's roof access. I put a bunch of seating so that settlers can look out at the lake. So they can sit down there and look at the gorgeous view. Um, there's one of my settlers now. She's looking good. <laughs> She's farming. Huh? Hi. Um, and this is really the only way into the air. Oh, where, I wonder where she's going to go. She's, maybe she's going to sit down. Are you going to sit down, lady? Yeah, she's going to sit down. <laughs> she looks very stylish. Um, so right now, this is the only way to get up into the everything that you see, like over here. So you go down this area, and then there's two ways to get up onto this platform here or over here. Um, eventually, I like to put crafting station, like a weapons workbench and an armor's workbench. I kind of decided that's what I'm going to leave this for. But I don't have enough material. I don't have wood. I basically used up everything. So, yeah, I'm out of wood. I have this turret up on Mr. Roth here. A few more turrets you can see, like, there. It looks so cool. I love it. This is definitely one of my favorites now. And there's a turret over there. Um, the garden's still pretty small. And just to show you close up over here, this is where people can sit and look at the gorgeous lake. I just love this. This is so pretty. Inside, I decided to splurge and I added a cooking stove here. And there's a chemistry workstation now and people can eat here. And here I added um, a little bit more uh, really nice furniture. There's a radio. And I added a cigarette machine. Um, hopefully these bugs will disappear eventually. Ashtray thing right there. Upstairs it's pretty much the same. Just more seating, a bed, more sleeping bags. Eventually I'll make this more um, sleeping room area. Um, but yeah, the brain fungus on the wall just adds that personal touch, right? <laughs> I Oh, and I added this painting here. It's kind of, you know, I paintings need wood, and I'm definitely splurging a little bit too much by using up wood like that. But yeah, I just have, I just have her. So, Taffington, I still only have two people. One of them are gone. So hopefully I'll get more people here. I can, you know, make it a little bit better. Um, I was thinking about increasing the water a little bit. I mean, I have a purification thing. I have a purification plant thing, but I think I would like to add, just in case, one more water. Can I stick it under this thing? No. Maybe I'll put it back here. No one ever goes back here. So, um... Yeah, I'm hoping I get a Brahmin and he can hang out in this thing over here. But this is where I put my purification thing. It's kind of like stuck back here. I just love this stuff. It's so awesome. <laughs> Alright guys, so that's the end of the video. I decided to make this settlement one a little bit long. Kind of showing you my thought process like behind how I build stuff. Uh, so it's definitely a little bit... Um, it was a long video. And next I'd like to... Um, try to see what's at that Malden Center. We kind of touched on that last video, finding the dead family members. So something's definitely over there. So that's where I'm going to go next. So I hope you'll join me for that. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.